back to my channel. So today's video is a little bit different, but basically it's going to be a really quick, to the point, Upper East Side cafe guide. So just in case you don't know, I've actually lived in the Upper East Side for four years on the same street. So I definitely have my favorite cafes and coffee shops that I go to and the ones I love and just ones I really want to share with you. I know lots of you visit New York, lots of you live here in New York. So I think this will be really helpful and hopefully you'll find a few cafes you didn't know about. So let's get right into it. Okay, so first I'm gonna bring you to a cafe called Corrado. It's on 70th Street and 3rd Avenue here in the Upper East Side and this is definitely one of my all-time favorites. I feel like it's a little bit of a hidden gem. I don't see this one a lot on different guides or different articles that I read and I feel like maybe because the inside is a little bit no frills, it's not the fanciest cafe you'll ever go into in New York. You know, you go in, you order over the counter, there's this big tall counter that sometimes I can barely see over. They have some pastries, some salad, sandwiches and you know it's pretty straightforward but the best part about this cafe is the outside area oh my god any time of the year I love this area they do have heaters during the winter and in the summer it's just perfect they have this really nice Parisian seating and um, simple tables and then there's a kind of a smaller bench at the front of the building and it is the best people watching spot like I literally grab my coffee I sit outside for 10 or 15 minutes before I come back to my apartment and you really feel as if you're in New York when you sit here and it's very Upper East Side you could see anything pass by so definitely recommend that one Okay, and the next up is definitely a more well-known place. It's called Mason Kaiser. I actually wasn't familiar with this chain until I moved to New York, and I live really close to a Mason Kaiser here in the Upper East Side, so naturally I became quite addicted. I love their iced coffee. I have had their hot coffee, and I do love that as well, but their iced coffee is so, so good with almond milk. And if you go to this cafe, I know this is more about coffee and like, coffee shops but you have got to try their pastries they have this one called i think i always just call it the mini white chocolate and they understand me because i can never pronounce all the different names but it's this mini little pastry with bits of white chocolate in it and oh my god it is so so good and also their chocolate almond croissant trust me on this one you will not regret it so definitely another one to stop by Okay, and then the next one is an Australian cafe called Hutch and Waldo, and this is a new addition to the Upper East Side. I think it's been here probably about a year, I want to say. I could be wrong, don't quote me on that, but it's definitely the newer one in the whole guide that I'm doing today. This place is so fun, and honestly, the Upper East Side really needed this. Like, I think since I've moved here, like cooler and newer cafes have opened, and this has been one of the best additions. It's quite small, definitely not a huge little place so perfect to pop in grab your coffee and head off they do have a small seating area if you can get a seat it's definitely getting busier and busier every time I go there so definitely add this one to your list as well okay the next spot is quite literally called coffee <laughs> they have this big sign on the outside saying coffee and it's a really really good spot as well the good thing about this one is that it's right next to the six train so if you live in the upper east side and you get the six train it's super convenient for you because you can just grab your coffee on the way to work or on your way downtown and also if you're visiting the upper east side if you're here on holidays and you're getting the six train once you get off the subway it's right there in front of you so really good location and as well as that the coffee is brilliant I've had both hot and iced coffee there loved both and they also have these donuts called dough donuts oh my god you have not lived until you've tried these donuts if you're a donut fan I love them and I actually have to like stop myself going to this cafe very often because every time I go there I want a donut <laughs> so if you go there and if you're having a treat try them and if not if you're just getting a coffee definitely recommend it Okay, and then last but definitely not least, I'm gonna put this one in as number five. It's called Le Pan 
this word that I can't pronounce. The one location of their chain which I really do enjoy is their location in Central Park on 76th Street. I love going here for a coffee and if you're in the Upper East Side, I definitely recommend it. I'm sure if you come to the Upper East Side, you're going to go to Central Park. Whatever time of the year it is, it's always a beautiful place to visit. And while you're in there, quite often you might want to grab a coffee or a hot chocolate or just something to keep you going. And this spot is the best. So I enter on 76th Street on 5th Avenue and then you walk down towards the pond where they have the electric boats you know you see all the movies and different tv shows and stuff and then just next to that they have one of these cafes and i always pop in there for either hot chocolate or an iced coffee so definitely another spot to look out for especially if you're in central park and that's it guys, five of my favorite cafes and coffee shops here in the Upper East Side. It was actually quite tough just whittling it down to five, but I think when I sat down and really asked myself which are the five cafes that I go to the most and the ones I truly recommend, those five are the ones. So I hope you found this helpful. As I said, I love coffee, I love the Upper East Side, so I figured it would be a fun video to film and it was an excuse for me to go to all those cafes <laughs> and get coffees and it was work, so very okay on my part as well. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, just in case you're new here, I would love for you to subscribe. I post new videos every Tuesday and every Thursday and sometimes bonus videos on Sunday. So that's it for today. As I said, I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next video. Bye!